I'm sure Tracy is driving everyone crazy, fretting about me, so I should put in an appearance. I am host of the party. And I'll make sure no one stumbled across that party favor that your operative planted. Oh, I don't get trapped on that boat. Why, Elena? I didn't know you cared. Well, I planned a little celebration. You know how I hate popping the cork on the champagne. I need a man to do it for me. Yes, you've always been such a delicate flower. <laughs> well, I'll be off the boat before the sparks fly. There's no problem with that, but you should get out of here before someone sees you. Nicholas? Yeah. Excuse me a moment. I have to have a word with someone. What the hell are you doing? Why are you here? And why did you just address me publicly? Well, I simply wanted to have a brief conversation, but there's no reason. Nicholas, because... who's this? Aren't you going to introduce us? Ivy, this is. I'm my... a friend of the Cassidyne family. Well, you two heading out to the launch? You're having a quiet evening at home. No, actually, we're going to Luke's party on the Han Star. I'm so impressed with the work Michael Quartermain is doing. I'm happy to support his new clinic. Yes, it's a very worthy cause. Nicholas, may I have a word with you in private? I have a date. It would be rude of me to leave her standing out here in the cold. I appreciate the concern. He's always so gallant. But the boat's right over there. I'll just meet you inside. Sure. Yeah, no problem. Have you forgotten that you're a fugitive? Nicholas, you cannot go to that party. I can and will go to that party. Oh, darling. Just write a check. Save yourself a boring evening. See, that's just it. It's not going to be boring. Because it's hosted by your new best friend, Luke Spencer. He was quite vicious to me the last time we met. I don't trust him. Need to keep my eye on him. I'm afraid I can't allow that. And I'm afraid you can't stop me. No. But they can. Gentlemen, 